Now, every once in a while you come across something and you realize that you're going to make a video on it, not because you want to, but because you probably should. So today I'm going to go quickly over what came up by accident whilst I was in the process of happily redoing my uh, VM farm post upgrade. So I upgraded my host hardware and then decided, well, now that I've got the extra hardware, I can create a few more VMs and demonstrate a few more complex examples. And that was kind of the, the reason for the upgrade. And in the process of doing so, I ironically enough hit this wonderful thing called too many requests when I was downloading the chocolatey packages to get the VMs up and running. And I had to ask the question, like, how did I manage this? At this point, I had run only what I thought was two packages per VM plus the chocolatey install itself. And under closer inspection, what I found is that a lot of requirements were in each of these packages. So the first package had uh, five requirements. The next one had something like seven or eight. So effectively in two packages and three VMs, I'd gone from what I thought had been, what, maybe nine requests in total, and it turned out to be closer to 40. The net result to this, obviously, was that I hit the throttling limit, or rate limit in this case, that has been applied to the chocolatey site. Uh, net consequence, quickly found myself unable to move forward for about an hour while I waited for the rate um, cap to kind of wear off. Now, that's not a bad thing, and I, I fully endorse the reasons that they're doing it. They do need a platform to be stable, and they don't want entire corporates using up terabytes of data um, when there's a perfectly good paid package. Now, I also have to admit, I've put in earlier videos that you can set up a chocolatey server relatively easily, and frankly, that's probably what I'm going to do for my VMs going forward, because I now realize that if I'm going to spin up two or three of them quite quickly, I will hit that same limit myself. Um, so, you know, as they say, you know, pre uh, practice what you preach, so I will go ahead and do that myself. I just honestly hadn't expected it, and therefore wanted to make everyone else aware of it too, that this can happen with quite a small number of machines realistically. Now what you'll probably have noticed is we've got three VMs going in the background and I'm happily installing packages and what I'm about to hit on the third VM is the rate limit. So I've got the too many requests uh, message pop up and that tells me that I have successfully reproduced my issue with just the three VMs that you have on screen. Now obviously I could do this in other ways and just you know happily uh, hit a couple of requests against the site, but I wanted to demonstrate that it's quite easy to do. Now in this case it was with two packages, uh, the SQL Server Express and the SQL Server Management Studio. So just installing those two packages on these three machines easily brought me up to 45 requests. I did do the count at the end. So. Hopefully they found this uh, video useful and you'll know not to hit that by accident and preferably build your own job server.